My name is Peter Kugelstatter. I'm a project engineer for Operations Division, New York District, Army Corps of Engineers. The name of this project is Maintenance Dredging of Shoal Harbor and Compton Creek. It's a uh, dredging project where we are clearing a harbor for a fishing fleet and a ferry fleet and finding beneficial use for all the material that comes out of that harbor. We had to segregate 40,000 cubic yards into a, a disposal facility, but we've got a lot of sand here, uh, 70,000 yards, and we're getting to put it on this beach uh, called uh, Port Monmouth Beach in uh, Monmouth County. The Army Corps has been dredging in the Shoal Harbor Compton Creek Channel for the last two months, starting 7 July, and we'll be done 14 uh, September this year. Cutter head dredge, basically a large suction pump, is sucking up channel sands and uh, pumping it approximately a mile and placing it through the, through the discharge behind us onto the beach. Dozers graded out to a predetermined template so that the beach is a functioning, viable beach. Uh, the sand, when it initially comes out of the pipe, has a dark, inky color to it but the sun will bleach it to uh, the same characteristic as the beach that was already there. We can't just put any material on the beach. We have to place 90% sand so that in our run up to the contract, we test all the material that's in the channel. Anything that wasn't 90% sand, we found an alternative placement site for. But if it is proper sand, then we can isolate those shoals and pump them towards the beach. We have a template, a height, eight feet, uh, and a, a depth down to the bottom that we achieve. We use the bulldozers behind us to, uh, to create that, uh, that template, we call it. And we're gonna build about uh, between 1,000 and 1,500 linear feet of beach on that template using the sand that we found. The Army Corps returns to our channels uh, we survey them every year, however, we only get to dredge them between every three and eight years, depending on the shoaling rates. The big shipping channels need to be dredged every year uh, because they're just in a bad place where sand comes in and fills up, or they're that critical that boats have to be able to pass no matter what the volume is, and we, we account for that in our process. Uh, this project has taken a lot of people. Uh, there's 20 people who have been involved, from the financials to the surveyors to New Jersey uh, DEP and the county. So we'd like to thank them for letting us get on this beach and finding a beneficial use for our sand.